Yeah, hello, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Hello. Uh, so I asked this question of James Marsters on Friday. Uh, so I have to ask you. Uh, we don't have to. Oh. You can ask me something else. I'm going to. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, we know where Captain John Hart likes to keep his weapons. Well, you know where I like to keep mine because of Doctor Who, I pulled one out of it. <laughs> That's, uh, that's Captain Jack. Personally, where do I keep my weapon? Yeah, where honoring your body do you like to keep your weapon? Uh, really? <laughs> really? <laughs> really? <laughs> oh dear. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh, I don't call it a weapon. <laughs> it's called my. Today also because I couldn't find anywhere. I've worn all my superhero underpants. <laughs> I couldn't repeat. <laughs> Some of them are just not in good shape anymore. I mean, the Transformers are like, no, oh, please. <laughs> uh, Megalatron. <laughs> no, so actually, I just they're freaking out now. So that, no, I don't. I'm weapon wise. I'm you know. I don't know. I'm not not really a gun person. I am one of the one of the only a few gay members of the NRA. But wait a minute. <laughs> no, don't boo boo boo. Scott, when I did, I had to do all the gun training for um, uh, for Torchwood and for all the other shows I did. You know, obviously because they wanted to be safe. So I have been properly trained in munitions and using machine guns and handguns and all sorts of weaponry. Okay. So I went and did another TV show about the remake of Dallas, and I went to a shooting range, and I never skeet shooted before. I'm really good. <laughs> Boom, pull, bang. And Scott, my partner, was sitting and watching me, and I, halfway through, he looks at me and he goes, have you done this before? I go, no, it's my first time. <laughs> and, I, and he said, it's not like you're hitting them on the edge. You're hitting them dead bang in the middle. And the woman was going, oh my god. <laughs> You are really good. <laughs> you like to hold my gun? <laughs> no, because you like to hold my gun. Because <laughs> you ain't gonna. <laughs> so, Scott, for my birthday that year, he went, just so you can cause a kerfuffle, he joined, got a membership to the NRA for me. <laughs> so I can walk in and go, hey, yo! I think that we all should do. That's what we all should do. We want, I, I'm, you know, here I get, I always like to have a little message with all the little silliness that I do. But, all, you know, I'm not for taking anybody's right away from the Constitution, okay? But that was written an awful long time ago, okay? And I, as a citizen of this great United States, you have a right, I'm saying you, not, I don't know who in here, but I'm, if there are, you have a right to have your weapon. But I also have a right. I have a right as another citizen of this country to have some control over that. So there's a balance, and the, the more of us who want that control, join the NRA, we can change those votes. <laughs> how, how can you tell the non-kind of committed member of the NRA? Everyone's crap, but anyway, never. Thank you very much.